Hey, Roxy, welcome to Get to Know Every One of Us. How are you doing today? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good. Just ending the day. I'm getting ready to head out in a little while. And I thought I would uh, jump on and we could have a little conversation so we could share a little bit about who you are with our friends on social media. So let's start here. Tell me a little bit about your family, where you're from. Tell me about that. Um, so I am married to uh, my high school sweetheart for the past three years. We're going on three years. Nice. Um, and we have a little girl, Darby Bell. She's 17 months. And we are from Irwin. We went to Penn Trafford. So we are still very close to where we grew up. And we love it. How long have you been together? Um, that's the weird part. We were, were together when we were like 16 years old. And then um, dated for like a couple of years. We're apart for 10 years. And now we've been back together for like wow. uh, five or six so. That's so awesome. I love that. That's a great <laughs> story. So how long have you been in real estate? Um, I got my license actually in 2013 and then um, kind of started full swing, full time. This will be my seventh year. Seven years. Jeez. I'm almost on my ninth. This is my 19th year. It's been, yeah. <laughs> been a long, long time. So you're just new to Realty One Group Gold Standard. You've been here for how long? Uh, I don't, it hasn't been a month. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. I love that you're on here already because there's a lot of people that have been here for five years and still haven't did this with me. <laughs> so I love that you're doing that and I, I'm happy that you're here. So tell me one thing that you love about being a realtor. Um, I mostly like the, the houses, getting to show something that's different. Um, that always seems to make my day. But I do like solving problems. Um, I just I say that we're constantly putting out fires. And I think it helps me think creatively and on my feet. And I think it just makes me a better, more rounded person. <laughs> I, I always tell everyone I'm a really good troubleshooter. So I'm, I'm that person that can figure things out, you know, and I think with being a real estate agent, it's taught me there's so many things every day that are unique, like things that you may have never heard in 19 years, you'll hear and be like thinking, that's never happened before. It's a crazy business. We do a lot of things people just do not realize. <laughs> so give me a piece of advice in today's market, because we know there's a shift happening. Give me a piece of advice that you would give to either a buyer or a seller or both. Um, I tell everybody the same thing, which is what's meant to be will be, especially in real estate, because if you are not meant to be in something, it is very much um, what is the law where uh, what can go wrong will. Yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm like, don't Murphy, worry. Is that Murphy's law? Yeah. I think the Murphy's law. You don't have to worry um, because trust me, if you're not supposed to be here, the universe is going to push you right out of it. So um, and then I haven't really change what I'm telling people because I actually kind of like where the market is. I keep saying it's kind of like it's 2019 again, which was great because it wasn't crazy and yep. buyers have, have a chance and sellers are, you know, their expectations are, you know, leveling out. So um, I don't know. I just think it's overall better. So it's a great time to buy and sell. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm with you. I agree. I think the normalization of this market is going to be a good thing. It's stressful when, whenever your buyers can't buy a house. And there was, you know, eight to 12 buyers for every house that didn't get a house in the 2020, 21 yeah. years. And, you know, now the chances are much greater, you know, and for the sellers, they're still going to get a good price for their house. They're not going to get exaggerated pricing, but they're still going to get a good price. So that is great advice. And I like that you kind of stick to your guns and you haven't changed who you are in the midst of that. So what is one of your favorite hobbies? Um, camping. We, we camp like crazy. We have a toy hauler camper. So pretty much every weekend in the summer, we are going somewhere. Um, and it used to also include a lot of quad riding, but since the baby, I don't find myself on that as much. <laughs> yeah. He is adorable. Where is she at right now? Uh, she's downstairs with my husband there oh, watching nice. cartoons, it sounds like. <laughs> she usually makes her way into the into our Zoom. Yes, so. she's usually in the background. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. it's, she's at a cool age. I'm sure you love it. Yeah, she's cool. So it's hard to ask this question so far, but you know, you've been at other brokerages and, you know, in your first month here, what is your favorite part of Realty One Group Gold Standard so far? Um, I'm actually like daily surprised by this group um, because there's just constant flow of 
good information and positivity to help people grow. It's like there's all these different Facebook groups that are centered around literally just motivating each other. I think that you guys have the best agents so far. I can't believe how willing everybody is to help. Um, and it's like, I don't know. I just, I feel like I was supposed to be here for a long time. <laughs> I wish you were here for the whole time. I was right. Yeah. <laughs> It's crazy. And I believe, you know, one thing I, I focus on in my career as a real estate agent is giving back and helping other agents. And, you know, I remember when I worked at a, one of the big box companies and, you know, they needed some help with a listing presentation. So I created one and then I did a presentation for the entire company. And I think that was one of my best years in business because I all I did was focus on helping others. So when we got a chance to get this brokerage, that was a big deal. Was how can we help the agents get as much money as they can, but also have the support and the technology, everything you need. It's not like we're a discount brokerage. What we are is we give back more to the agent who works their butt off to get it. So, you know, I, I think you can see that. And I, I think that you appreciate all of that. And it's so nice to watch you so quickly just become part of us without, you know, it just watching you is is awesome because i think other people are going to sit back and look and say well, roxy really just fits in like she she's been here for five years and and i love that and you're already taking a control of the branding and you sent me something the other day it was so nice and i knew you put a lot of time into it and you know it means a lot to me because i appreciate all the things that you're doing so we're glad that you're here and i hope that in two or three years whenever you want to come back here and, and do it again you'll have so many good things to say but is there anything else that maybe the audience doesn't know about you that you would like to share um i think most people know that i am totally absolutely obsessed with what i do um i'm actually like dealing with that just like I'm realizing that it's such a huge part of my identity and I'm like just kind of like taking it on. So if anybody runs into me and all I ever want to talk about is real estate, sorry, not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a great way to end our, our 10 minutes together. And I appreciate you and I can't wait to see you again. And I will, uh, I guess I'll talk to you very soon. Yeah, sounds good. Thank Bye. you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.